This has been a big year for Texas Central. We've moved this project forward from the feasibility phase to the development phase. We have Texans driving this private project from a big idea to reality. We've been speaking to people in the state, at the national level, and we're attracting attention from around the world. We're on a global stage now. We're ending the year with a series of open houses. We're meeting in communities, meeting individuals, talking to people about their concerns, understanding what's on their hearts and minds, and having an opportunity to share facts and real information about our project. Texas Central has taken several important steps this year. We're moving our project forward. We've raised capital from Texans, private equity, driving this Texas project forward, taking a big idea and making it a reality. In addition, design build firms with global expertise and experience in high-speed rail and years of proven track record in Texas building infrastructure throughout the state have agreed to go at risk and deliver design, build, and construction documents for the project. This is really important to us. In addition, our team is growing. We've hired more leaders, and we're also filling other key positions. All of this is helping us move the project forward at a faster and faster pace. We're bringing the world's best high-speed rail technology to Texas. This is a huge investment. We're going to invest over $10 billion in infrastructure, the trains, and the safety equipment. We expect to have a big economic impact, over $36 billion. That's not only the investment, but also the impact of employing people and operating our system for the first 25 years. We're going to create jobs. During the construction period, over 40,000 jobs. That's 10,000 people for four years. When we're finished, we'll have created a new high-tech industry for Texas, employing nearly 1,000 people permanently. And those jobs will be spread throughout the entire distance of our system. As a private company, we forecast that we'll pay over $2.5 billion in taxes during the first 25 years of our operations. Those taxes will go to cities, counties, schools, and the state. This project is really good for Texas. We have a lot of momentum moving into 2016. We expect to hit regulatory milestones with the draft environmental statement early in the year. It'll help identify the preferred alignment. We'll also continue the conversations with people in the communities where we'll operate. Also, we begin looking for Texans to start filling the jobs to build this project beginning in 2017. We have a great story to tell. I hope you reach out to us with your questions. We're bringing the world's best high-speed rail technology to Texas. We want you to be as excited about that as we are.